Hi, this video is about watching movies for free using torrent downloading. Um, I'm going to read this part right here. If you don't know what a torrent is, a torrent is sharing information like video, music, and software on the web. Um, what you do is you find a movie that you want to watch, then you connect to the correct torrent and it downloads to your computer. If you want more information, see torrent file on Wikipedia, or you can also search BitTorrent. So today what I'm going to discuss is torrent downloading. The first thing, I put these out of order, but the first thing that you really need, you'll need to go to the website Extra Torrent. That's where you'll be looking for movies. We'll do that first. The next thing you'll need is a program called Wireshare. You'll take the information that you get from the website Extra Torrent, put it into Wireshare and that starts the download process of your movie. Then to watch the movie I suggest you get it, the, the video player called VLC. The reason that I would get that is um, I've tried a lot of different video players and a lot of them will play the video then they won't play the audio or something will screw up. Seems like VLC is the best one out there. So let's go to the Extra Torrent website and I'll show you around. So this is what the website looks like. Up here is the, uh, the website, right there you can read it. Um, I already put a, a movie in here. I put Rogue One, a Star Wars story up here. Then I hit search, okay? And then I came down here. You have to scroll down and there's all these different listings. These are different torrents for the same movie. They're downloaded by different people. I'll give you another tip. If you look over here to the right side, there's an S and there's an L. The S stands for um, seeds, or yeah, my seeds. And if you click this, which I just did, it will show you how many people um, right now are sharing this movie. So if you get one that has a lot of seeds, a lot of people sharing the movie, it will download a lot quicker than if you get one that say, says like one or two people. So the next thing that I that you would do is you go over here, take your mouse over here, I click this last box. It's a green arrow over a box. Let me see if I can make this bigger. Hold on a second. Okay, so right here, it's a green arrow over a box. When you click that, it will show up down here in your left-hand corner of your browser that you're downloading it. You're not downloading the whole movie. You're just downloading where the torrent files are located. So you click on that box, and it will save it in your download files. So. We've, we've went to the Extra Torrent website and we found a Star Wars movie to download. We've figured out um, by getting the seeds a specific torrent that has a lot of people sharing it. Next we go to Wireshare. Wireshare, here's what the download page looks like. Here's their website. You can just Google Wireshare, but this is what their website is. Um, you download it right here. You just click on that. When you download it, it will look like this. Hold on one second. There you go. And then when you download it, you will um, you go to File. You either do the you either do this. Yeah, you do that on your computer. You hit File, and then it should open Downloads. And in this case, we would look for the torrent file for the Star Wars. Um, torrent that we just got. The next thing we need to do is so we've got the torrent, we put it into Wireshare. Once it's in Wireshare, it starts downloading the movie. I'm going to say generally for me that takes 15 minutes. Next thing to get is the VLC video player. Here's the page for um, VLC. Here's their website right there. Um, you just download it by clicking right here, and it's compatible with all these different uh, types of operating systems. 
So the only thing I didn't mention that I'm going to mention here at the end, if that's all you need, you can turn the video off now. Um, I will mention this. Your internet service pro provider might be mad that you're downloading movies for free. So to prevent that, what people do is they hook their computers to a VPN, virtual private network. Um, and that's what I've highlighted down here. All you need to do, um, and they're pretty easy to get. You can get free ones. I'm going to actually get a paid one. But if you go to this website, just Google the top 10 VPNs or top VPNs. There's companies that rate them. And here are, from this company, this is their top 10 VPNs. So they've listed 10 here, and they they tell what's good about them. They rate them on a scale of 1 to 10, and they put the website right here. ExpressVPN is one that's, um, I think you have to pay even for the first month. Uh, but there are free ones. Um, it's just, since I'm going to be downloading movies, through the VPN I want it to be fast and so I know that I'm probably going to have to pay for a VPN that's going to be fast enough. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any comments or questions just leave them in the uh, 